Heather, thank you for answering my call. How dare you, a mere mortal, speak to his lordship. Avert your eyes. My apologies. We this is AI-powered triple laser projector from Nomadic, and it claims to be the world number one smallest projector that can deliver 650 ants lumen with triple laser. Let's find out if this is a scam. In this channel, we don't accept their specs for an answer. We actually test out by putting so many long hour tests with different lighting ambient condition and the test of AI image optimization, four corner adjustment, auto keystone correction, as well as auto instant focus. I promise you that I'll be giving you all the details that you require in order for you to make decision. And let me be clear, I'm not here to make you purchase any tech before testing it out. Before we recommend anything, it must pass the mass consumer's needs. As we all know, everyone's needs are different. To save you time and money, we will test out and rate so that you know what exactly you're getting out. They say you can't judge book by its cover. In this case, we can start zooming from the packaging. To my surprise, it is well presented like an Apple product, but in a larger box. Inside, you would find the projector itself. First impression at closer look, it feels premium and you will find power cable, a USB type C cable for hooking up your gaming console or any other smart devices, quick start guide manual, a support card, a AAA battery, and a remote controller, which is a responsive. So far, it is a good start. I will give a five star rating as it comes with multiple items in the box, especially additional AAA battery and a USB type C. And not all projectors comes with all of these. So it's a nice touch. Moving on to the design. The Mnemonic L500 impresses us with a slick design and it looks something that comes out from the space. Just look at the curve, the shiny um, glass look at the front and the premium feel of this plastic richness uh, as well as the shape. It makes it look really um, modern look. The build feels solid and it's evident that attention to detail has been paid. So right here you would find the AI supported lens. I don't know if the camera can do any justice. It's got three triple lasers um, here. So there's a small one here and then the main source and then it's got the second one here and you've got a sensor right in the middle there. So the sensor is just to sense. So if somebody's passing in front of it and then if it goes out of focus, it kind of automatically reframes itself and also moves their focus. If for any reason somebody touches the projector itself, it readjusts itself the auto focus and the keystone correction happens simultaneously within a few seconds. So the projector is quite compact and quite unique as you can see itself. Uh, it measures 208 millimeters. Again, that's pretty small. If you measure it from the top to bottom, you have 92 millimeters. And then at the back here is quite small. Um, as you can see, it kind of shapes in a, in a tapered. I don't know if the camera can do justice. It tapers at the back here and you've got 165 millimeters right at the back. So you can see that um, it's well designed again. It's got the Harman Kardon speakers right here in the in the left and then you've got a some sort of a fan on the right here. So this projector comes with 600 ANSI lumen and we have tested using this light tester. The industry standard American National Standard Institute ANSI requires measuring nine specific points in 100% white image and using the average of all nine to calculate brightness. So as you can see here, when we measured, we've received multiple different readings by adding all of the numbers together. That gives us an average of lux times and by the screen size that gives us the ANSI lumen. Irrespective of what you do, if for example, if you move the projector forward, the screen size gets smaller and then the brightness gets a lot more. If you move the projector backwards and then the screen size gets bigger, and the light that delivers gets smaller. Obviously, the closer you are to the projector, the more it delivers the brightness. Um, so that's something for you to bear in mind, but the ANSI lumen shouldn't change. And what we have here, as you can see on the screen, the formula that we've used and our results is something that uh, you could expect. Although we did not get the exact measurements, but it is close enough to our four star rating. Now let's start talking about the key features of this projector. The standout feature here is the triple laser technology, which promises a vibrant and sharp images. It boosts a native 1080p resolution, which is ideal for HD content. And when plugged in with my 
Chromecast, it kind of upscales itself to 4K as you can see in this area here. Additionally, it supports AI improved contrast and color accuracy, providing an immersive viewing experience. For user experience, we are rating this projector four star simply because it does not come with Android TV built in out of the box, hence why we are using our Chromecast in order for us to improve our experience. Setting up the L500 is a breeze. You could either place it on a surface like this table here or mount it on a tripod thanks to the adjustable stand and the mounting holes. You can use the projector without using the remote. So you've got the power button here just by pressing that power button and it's got a few other buttons here which is easy for you to navigate around. So after powering it on, all you have to do is just connect to your um, Chromecast right at the back here and the power socket. So the first step of um, setting up your projector, all you have to do is pair your remote controller with your projector by pressing these two buttons. You have to connect uh, to your Wi-Fi in order for you to have that seamless service in terms of Miracast and any other devices. Then go ahead and update the firmware there onwards, you're good to go. As you can see, the setup was quick win, so therefore we're gonna be rating this five star. Now, the most critical aspect of any projector is the image and the video quality. We tested the Demonic L500 in various lighting conditions and it performed exceptionally well. The triple laser technology indeed delivers stunning, bright and vivid images. The colors are accurate, and the contrast is immersive. Whether you're watching movies in your back garden with family or friends, playing non-competitive games or giving presentation, this project handles it all admirably. Let's take a look at this short video. What a team! Where did you get that stick? It's fantastic! Good idea, stick! Hey, you want it? Yeah, yeah, yeah! If you can hold it for 10 seconds, it's yours! One, two, four, seven, five, four, eight, six. And this is an example in my bedroom. Um, I have the window opened about 50% and the brightness is still holding up really well. Although the brightness um, could be a little bit better, 650 ansi lumen is still great in my opinion. And at night you can see that it has much different contrast. During the daytime it can a little bit washed out and that also depends on where you're projecting. In my case I've got a white wall with a wallpaper. I'm going to be a little bit harsh by rating this four star as the brightness could be better during the daytime. In terms of audio, from a tiny projector like this, you would expect a low quality sound, right? No. I was actually impressed. The Harmon Cardone speakers delivers exceptionally nice quality audio, and for that reason, it deserves a five star rating. You can connect your smartphone to this projector by connecting the same Wi-Fi and then you can project it directly from your smartphone just by swiping it down on your iPhone. Once you've accepted the mirror cast, then you can watch from your 180 inch screen. So this is pretty good. As you can see, my son here is enjoying playing his game um, on this massive screen. We also appreciate the included of dedicated USB ports for media playback, which works flawless. This is an easy five star, why not? To wrap up things, I'm going to be rating the overall as 4.5 star due to the following reason. The L500 projector is a fantastic piece of tech that delivers on its promise. The triple laser technology along with the native 1080p resolution and the AI support result in a breathtaking viewing experience. It's designed to last long and user-friendly features makes it a great choice for a home theater system or a gaming setup. However, there is one feature we wish to see that's built in into this projector, which is Android TV, to make a user experience pretty seamless. So, if you're looking for uncompromising image quality and a feature-packed projector, the Demotic L500 is definitely worth considering. If for any reason your budget does not stretch this far, watch this video and we'll see you there.